we've been struggling all year. We're trying to, we're just want to get some kids opportunities. Mm -hmm. And I think that um, we had to mix up defensively some things. We, we didn't have Julie in there. So we want to mix some things up defensively. We want to get Jazz behind the plate because Jazz really hasn't caught too much this year. And she, she is our, our second catcher. So mm -hmm. just wanted to get her some time back there. Um, you know, you get to a point where you just, Get some kids in there and give them some shots and see what happens. Mm -hmm. I don't think that had anything to do with giving up 11 runs. Yeah. So, I mean, yeah, yeah. we didn't score, but the 11 runs is, is a totally different story. Too. Yeah. And last question for me. Um, a, lot, a lot of new, a lot of faces on the mound today, a lot of different arms. Mm -hmm. I mean, Ashley Diamond managing the pitching staff, what has she meant to the team this year and today and just her job behind the plate? Who, Ash? Yeah. Oh, I mean, all of our catchers have done a great job with our pitchers. I mean, they've worked so hard in the off season. Right now, we're, we're struggling. we got Lindsay Taylor injured and training room's got her out for a while, so we're trying to get her back. We're going to have to just make do with what we have. Mm -hmm. um, and so you're going to see, again, you'll see Q on the mound again. You'll see Danny and Lindsay and see what they can do. Um, as far as Ashley back there behind, I mean, it's, it's nice to have a senior or an upperclassman to kind of calm you down when you're a freshman mm -hmm. in the mound or on the mound. Um, so she's done a good job with that. Okay. Um, just you know, going back to the to the first game, Corin Corin hit a home run, um, and then like after that, you allowed um, DePaul to come back into the game. How frustrating is that for you? As a it's coach deflating. To that's the that's the it's deflating at first. I mean, you work so hard and you, sh you get some runs, and then they get a rally going and tie it back up. It's the, deflated is the, is the word that comes to my mind, but then you need to bring your team in, you need to regroup and say, okay, you got to let that go because now it's a zero zero ball game again. We're tied back up, so. You know, you have to move on. You just have to find a way then to continue to play. Um, and speaking with Jasmine before, she said that the team sort of has a tendency to let those um, errors get them down for the rest of the game. Is that something you've observed too? I really don't know with this team if it's about making errors and getting down. I don't quite know if we have found um, our leadership and our energy. Um, there's times where I, we're just, it's just a different team. So I don't know if it's about the errors. I don't know if. We're young, and a team needs to find themselves and kind of define who they are, and we still haven't done that. You know, we've, we've played great competition uh, early on. Right now, we're, we're just in a little bit of a lull, and it's time for somebody to kind of make a spark and step up and be a leader and get something done. You know, when you're, when you're down by so many runs in a game, in games like today, the only thing you can do as a hitter is keep focused during your at-bat and control what you can control. You can't control the rest of the game. You can only control your next at-bat, um, play the game the right way, and continue to play the game till the end.